What do you I, I What just, do you disagree with his well, policy? I, I there? think I have proven over the years that I'm going to get my work done anyway. So if I want to pay for myself to go to Boston, like there's people who take trains and planes when you know you have no idea if they're here, gone, there. You'll that's just happen to know. That's true. That's You'll true. just happen to know that I'm in Boston. But if I'm paying my own way, you know, going to the show and still working from the hotel room on Friday, like everybody filming is going to be in Boston. So there's like being in the office on Friday. It's not like I'm going to get more work done the, in the, the office. office. Will be dead. I'm not the gonna, office will be dead. I generally Nate get more, doesn't have a video product right, right now, so like and he is, he's gonna he write his a blogs. proven hard worker. I but mean, Dave's that, point is that part. if you give right, I can't. Well, pick I, and I say pick and choose. People who have uh, proven it can go. People who play video games can't go. Like it's kind of how not, it works. We're not throwing any <laughs> shots here. Gonna, listen, I'm not. We're only sending essential people. I think that just the message was never uh, given to people who thought that they would be able to go pay in their own way. Like don't show up. That was never conveyed to. Someone like myself. Uh, listen, the rule, if you can get there and back and not miss any time, you can go to Pup Punk. You just can't leave in the middle of the day on Thursday and you can't miss Friday. Right? I mean, if you could yeah. somehow magically do it, yeah, you fucking out, take a Uber blade. At 5, 530, you can leave the office on Thursday, get to Boston <laughs> by 7 o'clock. <laughs> and then get got, back. Got to be here to play video games. I feel you. Like, right. It's not going to play itself. So unnecessary, Nate. You're such a dick. Well, that's why it's like being in the office it's like isn't the end all be all because like somebody's job is to sit in the middle of the office and scream about Fortnite. Like, do I really have to be there for that? <laughs> I mean, it's Nate, funny because it, as, these, as, are, as, these uh, are big time uh, ricochet uh, shots. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> and Dave, so and Dave well, because the okay, but it, every time. it's because <laughs> the whole have to be in the office thing. It's like. You, well, you know the gif of Dave when he was like noodle and he looks I over and, and does that shrug? You're doing that over and over I mean, again every time Nate Smitty's makes a ricochet shot. savaged. Yeah. <laughs> he deserves it. And, I mean, and I honestly, Nate, well played you by you. You haven't disagreed with one thing. You're you like, knew, yeah, you're kind of right. What Nate. do you think about Smitty expensing Spider-Man? No! <laughs> what does that mean? <laughs> the video game? Smitty is fucking expensing video games now? Yeah. Well, I mean, it's technically it. part of his it. job. I approved yeah. it. It was brought up to my... I didn't approve it. Yeah, I, the finance said, uh, Smitty's expensing video <laughs> games, Spider-Man. Are you going to approve that? I mean, so I, 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 guess. I asked Smitty. I'm like, what do you do? All-time finesse. What can do you I do expense with the NFL ticket? Yeah, can I expense yeah. everything that, I Talk do? about picking and choosing. You're fucked yeah, now, that's bud. that's a good point. I mean, I'm going to expense... I would expense oh, internet, cable, everything. I'm, yeah, I'm, gonna, I'm, I'm definitely NFL expensing my cable. Ticket, you can just go to a bar and watch all the games. But I can't go to a bar in Boston. But and I, can I can't be blog out of my... So it's a weekend. What I are you talking about? I have to watch the sit home and watch the Redskins on the weekend, but you won't let me expense Sunday ticket. But, I mean... He, <laughs> Smitty, no, Smitty's answer was that he live streams. It's the most popular yeah, game. It's a true story. I mean, he, he, is not telling, he is not telling a lie. I will say that much. Wow. But yeah, I taught, I but when it. the foot is dropping over here and Good it's not him. dropping over there, it's a whole thing. But NFL Sunday ticket, like you can watch like Red Zone to work. Like I don't. Know, what do you need the ticket for? Well, you, uh, to, to watch, watch the games. Redskins games. Yeah, I'm gonna start a rival video game channel. <laughs> yeah, just <laughs> get that. your shit. Just get that. I mean, Donovan McNate, your the video games. I am a big. I'm fine with that. Fly Eagles fly video game guy. Night Fort. <laughs> like, get let's your video go. games expensed. Man, that's unbelievable. What a finesse. Good for him. Let's hit the break when we come back. <laughs> Thank you, Nate. You're so mean. No, of course. Like what, what Now I, he's on to the next thing he's complaining no, no, about. No, no. His NFL I'm, Sunday I ticket. I don't think I'm complaining. It's just like we both said that all three of us said the same thing. It's like, whoa, you can expense video games to stream it, but not like football to watch. Like we were just kind of shocked. There's The problem is there's no real rules about anything. So it's all as we go. So it's all everything's like a shock. Like will he see, say yes or no? Like it's 50-50 at all points. I'll say this. If, Nate, you walked into my office – with a closed door and be like, listen, I need to watch the Redskins game. I don't get it when we move to New York. Is there any way I can be helped out with NFL Sunday ticket or something to that effect? The answer may now change because I'm giving you this advice. But if you had done it in that manner to begin with, the answer probably would have been yes. I never would have thought to ask because no. it's like... Smitty's Smitty's clean yeah, the he's corners. A, he's a level above. Like, yeah. So you're trashing Smitty. We all I, say his no I, brain. I would say he we all expensive video games. This is gonna come down on me That's when he point. gets when he gets back from rehab. It's gonna come down on me that I was like trashing him. We all agreed on the same thing. Well, you were trashing him. Uh, we all were trashing him. Uh, you seem to mention his name quite often. I didn't say his name. Well, I'm talking about anybody could be out there. Clem plays video games. Anybody could be. You're the one who brought up Smitty's name. How dare you? <laughs> <laughs> it's kind of Again, facts. That's Nate spitting facts. Else. Nate, Nate brought up a hypothetical situation by playing video games. Dave said Smitty. 
Fair. Now it's a testament I, I to Smitty though. He has ingrained him. himself as the video yeah. game guy. I was here. saying great brand. Like first person you thought of. Hat yeah. tip to him. Right. Dave, sad. You should be nicer to your employees. <laughs> Touche, Nate. Touche. I don't know where that Smitty name can't, jumped into my head when you kept saying it smirking and the entire radio room would laugh. Remember you, he texted you, Jew, at like three oh. in the morning? Are we talking about Smitty oh. again? Yeah, because you brought this him up. This is a brilliant move by Nate. He came in here. He knew everyone was trying to rile him up for radio. He knew that he was being pitted <laughs> against Dave, and all he's done is come in here and bring up things that make Dave go, That does <laughs> make Dave laugh. <laughs> uh-huh. Uh-huh. You, when you just fire shots like that, you get the Dave smirk. It's the smirk. Like, I'm telling that, that same the smirk greatest the, thing. The gif on Twitter. Can, can you, like, it, it hasn't stopped. He's glowing. Mm-hmm. Like, getting the Look Dave. Look at that smile. Look at that. It's as, serious, as serious as he was on the I rundown. Don't 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 I'm being mad at you. He's that happy like, right now. I made no, this. I don't want I made, to see Smitty get. These are ricochet shots. Dave was. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> I, I, I think it's unfair what's happened to Smitty that he's become the bronze. I will say, I don't think you should leave or arrive at 11 and leave at 3. Right. Now, as if as he long makes as you it back for a, a radio segment, Sorry. are you okay with it? Oh, yeah. As long as he got his work done today, does it matter? Well, does he play <laughs> video games yet? Nate with the alley-oop. <laughs> <laughs> this was a roast session. <laughs> well done, Nate. Oh, uh, uh, Smitty texted me. Wait, what, is it, what do you say? This must not be a good text. <laughs> no, this is, this is, wait, this is not going to be good. Uh, 12 minutes ago, you're a fucking dick. <laughs> <laughs> I am shocked that you guys wait, even whoa, whoa. still have correspondence <clears throat> like that. Oh, we don't. I F- thought you guys were min- buddies. No, four minutes ago. All of a sudden. Like, I can't believe you. <laughs> like, I can't. I, well, I was about to say the exact same phrase. I can't believe that Smitty even, like, is surprised. Or, get, like, he, I mean, you've been doing this he doesn't for get, years. He doesn't like jokes at his, you know that more than anybody. He doesn't like jokes at his expense. <laughs> like, whole throw shots. At I mean, anybody, man in the mirror, Nate. No, I know. I'm not saying I do. Oh, I never, I never said I do. Yeah. But I'm saying you know more than anybody. He doesn't like jokes at his expense. I thought like you two thing. shook hands and I mean, and waved the white flag like two months ago. What I mean, happened? Yeah, I mean we were like oh, they're, no, they're, they're the too. couple. They're the couple <laughs> that breaks up and makes up. Breaks up and makes up. It is. It is. The most pure thing we have here at Barstool. The least fabricated. The least shtick. The least of it all is Nate versus Smitty. Smitty versus Nate. I it is so real and so perfect. <laughs> you yeah. could not. I mean, it's it's blogger serendipity. Who would have thought when we hired Tom Philly Nate and when we hired uh, Donovan uh, McNate was Nate the uh, all. Back the, with I mean, video games. <laughs> <laughs> Nate. I mean, you have to do it for the people. I, Donovan since, McNate. Here's the thing on video games. Since are we on the air? Oh yeah. <laughs> since we got home from World Series of Poker last year, not this last summer, the summer before, we've probably spoken. Thirty words between us, like in over you know, a year. Yeah, like, so so it's gone like I cold just, cold war. Like. I mean, it's just like it was. I did the whole Donovan McNate thing when he wasn't blogging the Super Bowl, and that was great. Like I got all the page views from that. It was fantastic. Someone had to blog the Eagles, so I did all that, and then I retired. I <laughs> I laughed from Dave. <laughs> so <laughs> it was like so, an evil deep. But after that, laugh. I I hung up my spider <laughs> monkey cap. Because it got everybody all stressed out. It got him, like, suicidal. I wasn't happy, you know, with a lot of things. So I, I hung up the, the, the cap. And I was like, all right, I'm just going to mind my own business. I get massive raises and all the oh, pages Jesus. now. And life has been great. He but you do understand what Dave just said about Man in the Mirror. Like, you I've been are better, the I mean. first... Yeah, yeah. To, to freak out about if someone did what he what you did to him, I mean, you would ha- like have him fired. It happens all the time, though. What do you, no. No one has ever Donovan McEric ever. <laughs> no one has ever tried to un- undercut you or undermine you. I'm always a step ahead, though. That's the problem. I mean, uh, that's fact. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you're you're a good blogger. I'm just saying. I get what you're saying. Obviously, yes, yes. yes. Anybody would be. Yeah. But again, that's the that's the purity of it all. YP, as you yeah. film here, is that the same guy who throws these rocks then gets mad when the when the rocks are thrown at him. It's so perfect. If people are mad at you on stool scenes for like sewer bombing Smitty while he's not here, are you gonna get mad at me? Yes or no? I just want to. I didn't know now. that he wasn't here. That's not your fault. He has rehab. I can't wait. I'm actually excited for him for, like, to get Smitty here. music to drop and have him come he's in. Gonna and he's gonna be so flustered, so mad at me. Should I respond gonna, to He's gonna text? try to use a word he doesn't know how to use. He's gonna say something from old English. It's gonna be fantastic. <laughs> Nate, yeah, where, say where are you? Where are you at? Yeah, be like, yo, we, I mean, we only have half hour left. Got to get here. Have a half hour left. <laughs> this is just... How's, one of these days, he's going to punch him. How's the shoulder? He's apt. <laughs> how's the shoulder? The <laughs> shoulder that will never heal. Right My shoulder's going to heal before this guy. <laughs> is he here? Let's hit a break. When we come back, we'll finally get to the calls. 
we'll rip through some of these topics, and hopefully we'll get Smitty back in the building. What a wild round show. For Smitty versus Nate, round like 35,000. I, I don't think it's a round. We're just talking. Oh, oh I mean, he, he said he, he called you a fucking dick and says he really can't believe you. You don't think it's a round? This might be the round. This is a championship round. Mm. After the break, we're back. Smitty. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, there he is. Brain, he's I back. Smitty's in. Sorry, John. He's in the house. With the flower. Smitty, uh, Smitty went to uh, rehab, and then Nate came in here, and ricochet shot it from fucking... A ricochet shot from hell. And Bunch of ricochet shots. Many ricochet shots. Uh, yeah, I just don't understand the topic or focus of conversation here. Well, uh, well, we started talking about no, company I know, policies. I heard, I, I, I heard, and I'm not sure. Exactly Dave was, brought so. up. Nate, shut up. Dave it, brought up expensing video games, and Liz brought up can we expense <clears throat> NFL Sunday ticket? Exactly. Spider-Man's one of the most popular video games right out right now. We have an ad deal going on with Sony. I expensed it. If you said no, we would have had a conversation. You said okay. End of story. Um, I probably haven't expensed, I'd say, like over 50% of the stuff I've bought for game time, including the... PlayStation and most of the streaming setup and all the games pretty much other than we fight to get codes for so I think that was a fair thing to do I, I, I approved it yeah approved so it. so it should have been end a conversation there I think it was kind of a mutually exclusive thing where each thing is separate and my situation I, I think different. that it comes up here like would you would you play that video game and buy it I agree without, I, you know I, I agree 100% but the fact that I was brought up without me being here and then just trashed for the last hour by this guy I mean, you know, it says a lot Wait, about your say character. That again? What did Frankie say? Frankie said that there has not been any streaming well, I've been from told. yet. That's because I just got it, and tomorrow night was going to be the first stream. And the reason why I came in at 11 today is I haven't been feeling well, but that's still not an excuse. I was streaming until one thirty in the morning last night. I mean, the, the showing up at 11 <laughs> and the, when you have to leave early is a bad look. I didn't, I didn't anticipate going to rehab today. They called and said they switched it to today. So. Got it. And, you know, hopefully I'm done rehab soon. It is what it is. But I don't know. I don't know, Nate. How's your day? It's great. Yeah. I mean, just to be brought up, just to be was the that, focus of conversation. I mean, that, I feel like this is the maddest you've been at Nate in a while. He, yeah. He I mean, was like, this is not a big deal. It's like, been, it, it, that text. Why did I bring it's up to the, the point? Uh, oh, because why why did did I, like company policy the, type shit. Because yeah. there's no rule. It's to the point that I'm not, I'm not mad anymore. Uh, like, he's irrelevant to me as a as a friend as a as a co-worker to this point uh after the dominic nate stuff where i talked to him many times i'm like hey i'm actually like getting upset about this like can you stop and he just kept throwing it right back in my face i basically i had followed him on everything not following him on twitter not following him on instagram haven't since and he's basically been like a like a little shadow to me what I'm if so he upset. does dominic nate on video games I mean, he can. I mean, do what he wants. I don't care. No, I don't you, care anymore. You'd explode if you no, did. I wouldn't explode because Dave, you kept telling me to find my thing, find my thing, find right. my thing. I found my thing. I, with virtually no help other than a person who's not with Game Time anymore. Like the right. social media sh following's huge. We got back on Twitch, and guess what? Well, since we left Twitch, I built the YouTube channel up to where it's very sustainable now. On Twitch. Last Wednesday, since our comeback, I'm top 10 on Twitch in the category I was in. Like, I'm working hard with it and trying to find a decent market in which Barstool isn't in. I, I don't even know if I'm the right guy for it, to be honest with you. But fuck it. I saw my alley. It's things that I might, again, might not be the best for, but that I knew I can take advantage of and do on my own and figure I'd be successful at it. And I am. Like... I won't call them being Ninja Boys, but like I've got connections with Ninja, Rockstar, Ubisoft, the big players in the world, and I think I've been doing a pretty good job. I don't longer have a place here where I can set up and just fire like the games up. That's why we need to schedule time in advance, which we get booked, bumped numerous times, which is why Nate's like yelling, oh, he's yelling about Fortnite Friday in the office. I don't know what else to do. I don't know what else to do. It's either I do it from here then or I go home and do it. Like, it's, I, I don't know what else to do. I'm working hard. I feel like it's been a massive success, at least in the gaming world. I'm not sure about here. We have ad dollars coming in. Fucking uh, Burst Liquid sponsoring us October 1st on. Like, I, I don't know what else to do. And, and I don't need credit. I don't need a pat on the back. I just don't appreciate being sewered for absolutely no reason whatsoever out of nowhere by you, Nate. That's what I that's like. That's like uh, a slow clap right yeah. there from uh, what is the movie Lucas? 
The sl- oh, that was his best. That was the most impassioned best speech you've had on radio. I mean, it's. I just get the best from him. It's I what think I it do. was pretty factually yeah, based, done. too. Yeah, yeah, I think it's 100%. Yeah. Mm. I will say, no matter how successful it is, and I, I get that e-gaming is like this huge space. It's a tough sell to, to when you're like, I'm working hard at it. It's a tough <laughs> yeah. sell. I mean, and I'm going to make Smitty, jokes Smitty, about you it. You could make like $10 million for the company this year. Pe- I you're agree. never going to be able to be like, and I'm working hard at night playing video games. And so I like, got very combative at that at the beginning, but now I realize that's, that's, that's just it how is how where it is. Be. I mean, our generation, when we grew up like that, it's different now. I mean, Fortnite is going to be multi hundred millions of dollars in tournaments next year. That's huge. E-sports I, I, I feel like when people used to say like, oh, you watch sports for a living. You write about sports, blogger in the great. basement. Yeah. And it's like you you used to be like, no, it's fucking hard. Right. Or, you know, it's it's a grind. And so like, like, like the next generation. Like, yeah, I'd love to be on radio. I'd love to have my own podcast. Actually, we're tra- trying to uh, the thing with Rooster Teeth again. Like, I'd love to be doing that kind of stuff. But this is the one thing. I mean, Dave, credit or no credit to you. I don't even know anymore. <laughs> this is the one thing that I've been able to do by myself. And it's basically just like, hey, Go you won't it. be bothered. And that's what I did. And I built it up. So. All right, props to Smitty. Nate, yeah. any thoughts? I wish I could play video games. You can, Nate. Nobody's stopping you. You asked when I did the Fortnite, uh, got my first win where it went viral, Kev. Mm-hmm. Uh, you asked me, hey, like, sh- should I, uh, how long do you think it'd take me to get a win? Like, should I try for a thousand? I'm like, yeah, man, sure. I was encouraging. And then you were, and you said, okay. And that was it. Like, Nate, nobody's stopping. I've asked you a million times. Oh, no, I was the, joking. I don't want to play video I games. I asked you a million a times since we did the poker stuff on Twitch last year, which got major play, major play. If you like to do something like that again, you've always gone, nah, nah, nah. Yeah, I nah. don't want to. Yeah, I know you don't want to, but it's great for the fucking... We were on Twitch playing poker right now, as well as online, like gaming stuff and competitive things around the office. It'd be huge, but Th- you never That always has to. been a thing, is that the Nate Smitty combo always has been a I'm willing to sacrifice you don't, you don't like to do it. my personal like relationship on the for Titanic. you for the company. It's like, why would you do it? The, the boat might be big, but you know it's going to sink. <laughs> Tommy. Tommy's face when that happened. These guys, what a mean thing to say. Yeah, you're just you're just a you're you're a bad guy and you're a hypocrite. That's what it comes down to. You're a, you're the most hypocritical person in this office. I do I'm doing an ad deal for fantasy football in the office. I like raise my voice on point decibel, like yelling about Rappaport or something. Shush. And they, I get the, the name shush. shush. Meanwhile, someone's gonna rip your head yeah. off. Uh, it's, it's Meanwhile, so this annoying. little fucker, the day he's playing for oh, 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 prancing, or, yeah, you're prancing oh. around with a tambourine like you're God's <laughs> gift to life. Like you're the biggest hypocrite here. The like, Nate, it's not even Nate close. Shush is gonna, and, yeah, we were, like, de- I thought I considered you a decent friend up until after Vegas when, like, you basically, like, ghosted me, which is fine. I don't care. And you, like, act around like you're part of one of the cool guys here, like, think your shit doesn't stink all the time. Like, you're a fucking loser, Nate. You're a loser. You're a hypocrite. Ooh. And, like, it's, Ooh. I'm out tired. I know. I, should, I, sh- I really shouldn't like it, but I'm, like, rubbing my hands like I'm, uh, like, <laughs> like just, this is this is yeah. some stuff. And I don't ben care. And I don't put together Smitty's ever been and I, on Oh, there's a great appearance I mean, by Smitty. And I don't yeah. care what you do. You can do whatever you want. Even if you want to play video games or play poker again, that's great. That's what's great for the company. But keep your my fucking name off uh, your lips for I say half his, an Kevin, hour. Did I say his name? You Kevin, did I say his name? You're such a loser. I mean, that is. You're such a loser. Yeah, I don't think I said his like name. Like you brought him into the conversation. Because you, I said I can't be in the, I don't have to be in the office on Friday yeah. because it's just like loud as shit playing video games. I can do that from Boston. And That's every single, every single time someone comes up to me when we're in private, like at a bar or something, oh fuck, Nate, he's a loser. I'm like, nah, he's a good guy. He's a good guy. I'll continue to say that because no one deserves the kind of treatment no, that, that, we get on a that personal ship, basement. I think, has, no, because I will, because I will, because nobody deserves like to be trashed the behind their back like he's doing to me. I'm a bigger man than him, physically, mentally, emotionally, <laughs> spiritually. I'm better than you. You unfollowed me on the Twitter. I did. <laughs> Shirt. <laughs> I did. I did unfollow you. Mentally on Twitter. stronger, but unfollows because you can't handle one joke about the but Philadelphia the Eagles. Because no, I don't need to say that when it, you Nate. like played the mental health card when you were getting made fun of. No, but I'm saying he. I'm. He's saying that he's like this mentally strong guy, but he unfollows no, everybody on Twitter than you. over more mentally strong than you. Blogs about difference. the Eagles. You know, I'm, I'm, like, I'm the tallest the in the circus when it comes to mental. Just clown and misfits here at Barstool. It really is, but you know they'll be friends again one day. You two. I mean. No, when it's all when it's all like you guys, after this. No, like, they're you, they're like, with, they're with us like me, however you want to look at it, forever. I think, and you guys will get along again. I I, <laughs> I believe that in my heart. That's, of hearts. that's the most disingenuous thing I've ever heard. You no, really I, believe that? Yeah, I do. 
that they'll, that they'll be like friends or that they'll be cool? No, like, they'll be like, friendly like, again. Cordial They're in a phase. I don't care. The I sort of funk. I've always been friendly with I would say we've been always been, been friendly. cordial. Like, no, I'm, I'm still going to be friendly and cordial in the work environment, but like personally, like I, I, mean, I just don't understand where this comes from. I just from heard today. this rant. It didn't sound like Because I've been put in a position, boxing in the corner, where I need to come out and do something drastic and defend myself. If you two matched up size-wise, would you fight him? I'd, 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 no, I'm not fighting anybody until my shoulder's okay. Well, but. right, right. Take that aside. I'm just saying right now I feel like the one thing that, that was, stops it is that, that you're going to fuck That's him. where you hit. That's where you uh, Frankie. That one made sense there. He's oh, been brilliant. About, that we're talking about hypotheticals. Now. Yeah. Nate, yeah. do you know what a hypothetical is? Yeah. That's, oh. that's a question. Were you here for that? Yeah, I was here. Uh, for, yeah, I was here at 11, yeah. like you said. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> Would you fight him if your shoulder was healthy and you guys were a fair, fight, uh, fair matchup? Sure, Kev. I mean, well, I, I, I'm impressed matter. that you haven't. Like, I want to rip his head off. And, and I'm not allowed. He's allowed to. He's allowed to touch YP. I'm not allowed to touch him. Mm. Oh, that's because YP got bodied too. <laughs> no, it's very. It's a very fair argument. I, I bet you would. No, it's a. Uh, it's a very fair argument. He he's allowed to sh- get angry and hit YP at will. Imagine if I did that. I'd be fired on the spot. Would you fire? No. If what? If Smitty like punch Nate. No, I, it would be good. If for you the fired company. Smitty no, for that, I, I would, I would have, I would have, I would take umbridge with There's that. There's no, no way, Dave. No, would. no, no. There's I, a, like no, anybody else, fine, but there, that. No, because Smitty's just so much bigger. <sighs> but he's allowed. Right, he's all right, allowed right, again. Attack YP. If, yep. if he YP, punch there. Wait a minute. No, no, no. That's totally different. Like okay, so let's not say punch. If Nate, if Smitty like I mean, shoved Nate it, to the ground. In what environment? There's no way you would. The fire same him. environment that Nate shoved YP down. No, I would not fire him. I thought you meant if he just like clocked you. I still wouldn't. If there's any sort of physical altercation between those two, you have to. Like like, YP was like camera. He was all. He like tried to just push him. If it's an intentional walk up, shove to the ground, you'd fire him. Or it has to be a punch. I'd have to see the sub. Like you can't. You like Smitty couldn't like. Give me an inch, Dave. Give me an inch. (laughs) (laughs) Like my point being that if if there's ever a situation to let it slide, I think I think we should put that out to the public opinion, and I think it would be like, don't fire him. No, you couldn't punch him. If Nate, the question was, if Nate was coming at him verbally, which he does a lot, you can't respond in a punch. No, it's like well, one time. It's like remember when Rome put needles all under Frankie's asshole? Yeah, like that. You can't do. There's certain things you can't. Do. Can't inflict physical harm. But it, I'm just saying, if, if it was Nate ever a time would, to if allow Nate was it, no? like oh, the aggressor, then yes, right. But then Nate would have to be fired. It's such a weird if thing. Nate, whoever break. Well, the whole, wait, wait, wait. Kevin, so if Nate, if Nate makes physical contact with Smitty, you're not going to fire him. If he like bumped him. What Nate, if he but ran he, at him and grabbed him on the shoulders and tried to push him down, whether or not he <laughs> succeeded? I don't think he'd get fired for that, no. That seems like Nate a double standard. Ha- well, yeah, because of the size differential. Like, I think it's... I think that's unfair, Dave. Smitty. <laughs> it is a welcome to Smitty at Barstool. <laughs> yeah. Hey, what are you it, it, see, that's the thing. The weird thing is Smitty's brand for a while in blogs was like he took shots at everybody unprovoked. Like oh, It was yeah. like his thing for a while. Mm-hmm. But then like... But you did take like a cup. I mean, nobody read yeah, them, but yeah, like we were in you take cities just like you, oh, you know, right, right. Like, that was his thing for probably like over a year, and nobody said a word. You take like one shot at him uh, now, about everybody was kind of anything. Doing it too. Uh, I also think that and it's a lot more personal when you're in like, the same I'm being spots. like railroaded right now for doing what he did to everybody for like well over a year, exactly. And I grew up, Nate. I'm ho- not really because you play video games in the middle of the office, mm-hmm. and I'm making this company a lot of money this year. About time. <laughs> it's it's, it's crazy. Forth. It's perfect. I, I the repartee. Feed it to me. It, it, feed it I to mean, me. it's unbelievable. <laughs> it's perfect. You guys, this is why you you always we should have locked you guys in an apartment together. Well, we I mean, you guys, but you guys won't do that for the company. Remember when I came to you and said Nate should be my manager, Rough and Rowdy? How much more downloads do you think we'd get if Nate was you, the manager? He refused to do it. Yeah, yeah he Nate refused always to refused. do it. Remember when he was Would you to be the coach basketball team? You still Nate, are going to extend any to, of these to invites? Quote Nate, I, why would he get on your ship when he knows it's eventually going to sink? That's what he thinks. Well, I'm not saying he's right. Problem. That's what Nate says. I mean, the Titanic was the largest luxury liner for a while. <laughs> for like oh. half a trip. Yeah. <laughs> and it's still known to infamy. Wait, do, 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 do. <laughs> that was like the first, the maiden voyage. It, it sunk on the maiden voyage. He's not wrong though. For, uh, for, a, moment, for, for a, a moment, for a moment, there was some Brief. big hype for the Titanic. <laughs> yeah, big time. No, but I mean, I'm establishing a brand. I'm doing a good job doing it. I mean, Nate's, Listen, Nate's a blogger. I'll say this to Smitty's thing. I don't know on the video. To to I like find your niche. Even uh, there are complaints like Smitty doesn't blog at all, basically. And I talked to K. Marco. And about you're a that. bad blogger. Well, that's your opinion. 
Well, no. I mean, the stats back that up. Either then it's either because well, I'm right because I'm writing about Philly sports. That's all I'm writing about anymore. Well, it's either lack of effort or you're not a good blogger. Okay, I, but 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 when I do a vi- way, when I do a video that's the third highest ever watched on Barstool's history for YouTube, like does that account in anything yeah, that, I'm doing this year? That was a big, big like the ninja video. But that's all right. That's not like. But, like, but, like, but wait, to be wait, fair, wait, like wait, when, yeah, when your pizza review year? when yeah. your pizza review did numbers, you were like wait, 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 spouting no, off no, about that's it. Nobody. Exactly what I'm saying. I'm saying uh, I'm not saying a video is a blog. I'm saying when I say blog, I mean you can't write. You write like a. a Block it. Um, so find like a niche that that you can be successful. At. We've had that conversation. The video games I do think is working. So that I'm considering the ninja part of that. So when he gets made fun of for the video games, I'm openly being like, go play videos. I'm still gonna make fun and, of it. And now uh, you said we were top ten once you got Twitch back. Like you've been. Yeah, when I did an eight, and and eight and a half hour stream last Wednesday night. Uh, What's the schedule on that? It's Sunday, Wednesday? It's usually Sunday, Wednesday, Friday if we get office space on Friday, but it will be enhanced a little more upcoming October. Now, uh, that was a decisive W for Smitty in my mind. Judges, agree? I think it was Smitty's best performance he's had. One little hiccup. Octagon, although that uh, analogy comparing himself to Titanic Not great. will but, maybe. But the idea was sink, walk no away, go out on top, but he's back because he wants one more thing to say. Yeah, just on a personal level, Nate, when you got pied in the face that night, uh, who was the only person with you who uh, stood up for you, who kept it quiet for you, who, uh, What's that who have had to do your with back? The plot I mean, thickens. just on a personal level, like you're saying. Like, what else would you have done? I don't even understand. What else would you have I done? Th- I said, like, I'll go back there and find the guys. You were and still the there and you didn't. I was not there. I was you in the still- Uber. I'll show you the text right now, Nate. But like I, I was there, I could have. I, if I didn't like you, or excuse me, if I didn't respect the barstool atmosphere, what else would you have done? That doesn't make sense. Well, I could, I, I, I could, I could have put it on the on, exactly. On I don't exactly. think you, no, we wouldn't have. Oh, Nate, I could have made no, that into like fire content right away. Probably I don't know, not. Nate. I don't think that would have looked good on you at all. I don't know, Nate. I, I don't know. No, so well, you should have just left mean, with the I win. I would have done it. Maybe not in that exact instance, but I think there are a lot of people who will. I, I mean, I didn't know that Smitty was even there that night, mm. and he kept it that much. And I didn't force myself into content because I knew, like, it was something that, like, really affected you, and, like, I didn't want to bring I mean, you down did. at all. No. I don't understand that at no, all. No, I would just... Should have like, left with the win. No, I think that's I a pretty, I think that that's one, pretty that personal weird. I mean, that, Yeah, it's a personal thing for sure. I mean, but so... But I also think that what he's saying is when he was, like... He made it clear, like, the shit you're doing is now really starting to bother me personally. It kind of would have been Yes, and he feels like he's been a friend to Nate. Nate feels and, like he hasn't and been. Nate, well, no, Nate throws him under the bus every right. two seconds. I mean, he built his entire vlogging career on taking shots at every single person in the office. It's a false. I was a stand-up comedian for three years before I started a blog. I incorporated I, I, I mean, what? stories. I, I don't think that's true. I, I, I never got that vibe from Smitty. That I mean, maybe the, the, the DM, mm. the infamous DM, but I never was like, Smitty's blog is always well, talking shit not, about me. That was certainly not. That's different. I'm just saying, I, I never I never got that vibe, really. I don't. I can't even remember a time. I'm sure he did it, if that's what you're saying, but I don't, don't remember a time ever being like, okay. Smitty ricochet shots. <laughs> No, I, I agree. I, I've honestly, taken, I don't I've know. taken like pot comment section shots before at people in blogs, just like thinking they're funny, especially before we knew each other and like we're all in the same. I thought it was just like, oh, it's fine. We're talking like 2013, 2014, but to say I built like my brand on it, right? I think it's a little excessive. Sorry. Tried to, it wasn't funny enough to, but tried to. <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. It, I mean, Nate, 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 you bring up you, you, <laughs> you take more shots at anybody now than anybody. It's not even close. It's not even close, Nate, in your blocks. Why do you hate Smitty so much? I don't hate Smitty at all. <laughs> so do you just think it's funny? Yeah, I just make jokes. But you make the most at his expense. It's, I mean, so yeah. when I was doing so it, the real problem always comes back to when jokes are at your expense, you have the, the same reaction. That's the real problem. If you were just like, I'm, I'm mean, and when someone's mean back to me, like, fuck it, I, I mean, think I it would used, go over better. I mean, I used to be, but like... I was told by Gaz. It all goes back to the Donovan McNate thing. I was told by Gaz to do that. I told Gaz, I don't want to do that. I don't want to do that. Classic Gaz. And he was like, no, like we need like someone to do the Eagles. Like, you got it's Gazzed. not being done. And so I did it, and Dave 
said, I, I think I went into your office. It was like, I don't want to do this. And you're like, no, you should do it. Like, yes. And it, I stand by that. Right. Like, and that, so I get, th- I get killed for all this stuff. Like, and it you was didn't, you didn't get, but, but, but it came down to the point when I legitimately man to man said, Hey man, like, this isn't cool. Like, can you stop it? And you throw it right back in my face. Cause I was doing what Dave told but me. Why to that? See that? Well, and that's and good these for are the different company. Things. Yeah. Like yeah. I, for me, I would never be like, I won't want like that was good. Like we, we right. needed more it, Philly it, it, in it. Like create a sub. Like it not only we did we need like, Philly blogs. It was creating more. But 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 he was taking the shots on me in the blogs. He was doing it not to cover Philly. He was doing it to straight up body bag me. That was the only reason he was doing it. He I was taking that. shots in the blogs. He was when a big news story will come out. I'm either doing a video from Rough and Rowdy or was on serious during the Super Bowl weeks. He's not ta- he's not texting me saying, "Hey man, this is up like what we do with each other when something comes up that's near and dear to us." He would get it up in his blog and say, "Oh, Smitty sucks again." I'm a weasel. Like that's what he would do. That's all what he would do. I was told buy your balls to get Philly blogs up, and you did. Take and that you up just, with And it was just at my expense in every single blog. It was all about oh, he plays video games. Oh, he's going to get his dick kicked <laughs> that was in a rough you around. Were video games. Like what? Like, I want to go back and look at these blogs. <laughs> the now, gruesome two because it's what a pair. Like I understand there will, never, there will never be another. This is this is a once in a lifetime duo. Yeah. You're going to go back to the blogs because that's the only thing you have, like, in the mind right now that you think that could be ammunition. I mean, what? I don't understand half the things you say. I think it pretty much made sense. You did. Smitty and Nate. Nate and Smitty. The odd couple.